Lexus made the most efficient electric crossover on sale. Here's how. Hey there, EV lovers. Welcome to EVpedia, your ultimate hub for everything electric vehicles. If you're as pumped about the future of transportation as we are, then you've come to the right place. We're here to bring you the latest news, reviews, and tips on all things EV. But before we dive into the electric goodness, we need your help to keep our battery charged. So, if you enjoy what you see, give that subscribe button a little love, hit the like button to show your support, and drop us a comment with your thoughts or questions. We promise, we read every single one of them. A certain combination of wheels, tires, and powertrain can boost the range by dozens of miles. Lexus and Toyota aren't known for their EV leadership. Both brands offer only one all-electric vehicle, and neither model offers particularly compelling range or charging specs. But when Lexus published efficiency data for the RZ300e, our audience was shocked at how well it did. We asked Lexus for details on how the base model RZ quietly became one of the most efficient EVs on sale. If you're unfamiliar with the RZ lineup, I don't blame you. The base model 300E joined the lineup in 2024. Lexus was already selling an AWD RZ 450E, but the FWD model is way more efficient. The base model gets 125 MPGU, equivalent to roughly 3.7 miles per kilowatt hour including charging losses. That's more efficient than a Tesla Model Y. It's the most efficient EV SUV on sale, and one of the most efficient EVs period. Only a handful of 2024 model year electric cars achieved a higher result. Three cars, the Hyundai Ioniq 6, Lucid Air, and Tesla Model 3, in a total of seven versions are more efficient. The question of how the Lexus RZ300e became so efficient is fascinating because the original 450e version is far behind at 107 MPGU, 315 WH, slash me, or 3.2 miles per kilowatt hour. Plus the Lexus is far more efficient than the Toyota BZ4X on which it is based, which gets 119 MPGU in the EPA cycle. That's an inversion of what we typically expect. Luxury vehicles are heavier and therefore usually less efficient than their mainstream counterparts. Inside EVs asked Lexus slash Toyota to confirm the RZ300E's results and about why it's so much more efficient than the 450E. Lexus spokesperson Laura Finley confirmed 125 MPGU as the correct rating. As it turns out, there are several reasons why the 2024 Lexus RZ300e uses less energy than the 450e. First of all, this version has a single-motor, front-wheel drive powertrain making 201 horsepower, compared to the dual-motor, all-wheel drive 450e that produces 308 horsepower. This one change removes some weight and reduces the axle friction from the rear axle. The RZ300e's base curb weight is 4,277 pounds while the RZ450e weighs in at 4,564 pounds. Another efficiency boost comes from the front e-axle inverter. In the RZ450e, the inverter semiconductor is made out of silicon SI. In the RZ300e, Lexus uses a silicon carbide, SIC, semiconductor, which is more efficient. I'd guess this change improves efficiency by a few percent. It'll be interesting to see whether Lexus brings the CC-type semiconductor to the AWD version in the next update. For now, the SIC is unique for the RZ300e. It's not used in the FWD version of the Toyota BZ4X, which may explain that model's lower efficiency rating. Finally, the Lexus RZ300e has different wheels and tires than the AWD version. The rear tire width is 235mm, the same as the front, instead of 255mm. On top of that, the 300e has a higher factory tire pressure. 42.1 PSI instead of 33.4 PSI. The combination of the changes resulted in a quite significant efficiency improvement. The Lexus RZ300e gets a slightly bigger battery, too, 72.8 kilowatt hours instead of 71.4 kilowatt hour in the AWD, but that's a very small change, 2%. The range improves by over 17% from 220 miles in the 450e to 266 miles in the 300e, so it's clearly more than just the battery. As the RZ shows, there are many small changes you can make to an EV to get a big range boost. If other manufacturers take note, hopefully, we'll soon have more 120 plus MPGU SUVs to choose from. The 2024 Lexus RZ 300E Premium with 18 inch wheels is a front wheel drive, FWD, vehicle featuring a 72.8 kilowatt hour battery, providing an EPA estimated range of 266 miles. It can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 7.4 seconds and has a top speed of 99 miles per hour. The base price is $54,000, with an additional destination charge of $1,150, 
bringing the effective price to $55,150. The 2024 Lexus RZ 300e Premium with 20-inch wheels also has a 72.8 kilowatt-hour battery and FWD, but its EPA-estimated range is 224 miles. Its acceleration and top speed are the same as the 18-inch model. The price is $54,000, with the same destination charge, totaling $55,150. The 2024 Lexus RZ 300e Luxury with 20-inch wheels is a FWD model with a 72.8 kilowatt-hour battery and an EPA-estimated range of 224 miles. It has the same performance specs, accelerating from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 7.4 seconds and reaching a top speed of 99 miles per hour. The base price is $59,730 plus the $1,150 destination charge making the effective price $60,880. The 2024 Lexus RZ 450e Premium with 18-inch wheels is an all-wheel drive, AWD, vehicle with a 71.4 kilowatt-hour battery, offering an EPA-estimated range of 220 miles. It can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5.0 seconds and has a top speed of 99 miles per hour. The base price is $58,700, and with the destination charge, the effective price is $59,850. The 2024 Lexus RZ 450e Premium with 20-inch wheels features the same 71.4 kilowatt-hour battery and AWD, but its range is 196 miles. Its acceleration and top speed remain consistent with the 18-inch model. The base price is $58,700, with a $1,150 destination charge, totaling $59,850. The 2024 Lexus RZ 450e Luxury with 20-inch wheels has the same specs as the premium AWD 20-inch model, with a 71.4 kilowatt-hour battery and an EPA-estimated range of 196 miles. It accelerates from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5.0 seconds and has a top speed of 99 miles per hour. The base price is $64,430, and with the destination charge, the effective price is $65,580. And that's a wrap for today's episode of EVpedia. We hope you had as much fun as we did exploring the world of electric vehicles. Remember, your likes, subscribes, and comments are the sparks that keep our motor running. So, if you haven't already, click that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and let us know what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and stay charged. Until next time, keep it electric.